Hey Philly and welcome to Master Crafters. Today we're going to be showing you 8 fun ways to use a TNT. Now before we get started I just want to tell you this is all using sort of the same system where we have an observer detecting a block update. So as you can see here we have redstone down here and if I place the dirt on the observer or break it then the redstone will light up. Now obviously you do want to prime this system and what I mean by that is by placing the block or anything on the observer first then placing the TNT because if you don't and let's just say you place it, I'm going to break it here, it will ignite the TNT so always place the TNT last because that it can be your worst mistake. Also when placing your observer in the correct spot I would dig down three blocks down and two blocks wide and then you can go inside the hole here place the observer up like this because the face will actually be up at the front here and then you could just cover this up by going up the second tunnel here and boom your observer is ready to go so first up we have the jukebox here and as you can see we don't actually need a detector for the jukebox because if you place a music disc in the jukebox it will actually send a redstone signal itself so you don't actually need an observer. Next up we have the door explosion because if your friend decides to open his door here then you'll see oh look it's a detector wait a minute why? Yeah that that will happen so the these tricks can be a little uh, dangerous so I would only use them on your friends if they're okay with it. Okay, the next trick here uses a bed, and we actually have a daylight sensor down in here. So when we use the bed and it turns daytime, the TNT will actually ignite because uh, you slept in the bed. So if your friend were actually to sleep in the bed here, and we'll wait here for a second, then it will actually ignite the TNT because it's morning time and it should ignite there we go and there we go so now this system is a little tricky because you will need to prime it the night before your friend sleeps otherwise it will actually blow up on its own so it's it's got its flaws but it can still work now the next two here you've probably seen before because they're classic tricks, but over here we have a chest hooked up to an observer with TNT down in there. And if we were to modify the chest here by placing anything in the chest or taking it out, then it will set off the TNT and big explosion. That's kind of weird that it did not destroy the chest, but explosions can be weird. The next one is by tricking your friend here. And as you can see, the observer, you can't see it anywhere. So if you place a block of diamond or a block of gold or anything else like that, like uh, iron maybe, and if you were decided to break it, then it will send a signal down, igniting the TNT and everything around it. Now the next one here can be a little hard to set up, but if we have a detector rail here, and you don't actually need an observer here because the detector rail will send an input down to the TNT. If you were decided to put this in your friend's railroad and the minecart goes over it, it will send a signal igniting the TNT. There we go. This one is another classic here, but if your friend has a trap door, then you can actually place a TNT down one block under it and it will actually set it off. So. If we were to put this in front of a door, it would look very unsuspicious. So if we were to use it here, then your friend would go in and big explosion in their front of the house. Now the last one here is a bit weird, but if you were to place a random button or a random lever in the side of a mountain, you can actually cover the mountain in TNT. And if your friend goes like, oh, hey, a random button, I want to press it or a random lever, I want to press it, it will ignite the entire mountain, probably lighting up your friend, and as you can see here, it did a whole ton of mega damage. 
So guys, I really do hope you like this trick video. If you do like it, please give it a like. And if you do like our videos, please consider subscribing to our channel because it helps us out a lot. We also have our social media and our website down in the description below. So thank you guys and have an awesome rest of your day.